By its very nature, geolocator work requires two years. So during the first year, we catch birds, ban them, and attach geolocator to their backs. The geolocator is a really small device that records daylight, which allows us to pinpoint approximately where on the earth the bird was. Nine, five, two, he's enormous. Can you get the banding numbers? Oh, two, six, eight, zero. It's really incredible when you hold a golden winged warbler in your hands and recognize that a nine gram bird can migrate from, for example, Pennsylvania to Central America. Geolocators allow us to study the migration of this small songbird. Where do they go? So the geolocator study from a golden wing perspective and a cerulean perspective are intended to fill that final missing information. Cerulean warbler males are, are just arriving at the sites and this morning we came out early before the sun was bright. So I had a bit of an adrenaline rush when this bird flew into the net, and it's just so exciting to get this data. And this was our first returnee with a geolocator. 9.22, so he weighs less than two nickels. We want to do everything we can to catch every bird that comes back, and it made me very happy to catch him right away. Typically we wake up around 4, 4.15, trying it out in the field right as the sun rises. That's, that's pretty good. How are you over there? I think we're solid. Yeah. All right. See if the other ones need help. Oh, man. These netting conditions are not ideal. Got the playback here. We put out the mist nets to capture goldwing warblers with geolocators attached to them. So ideally, that bird comes back to the very same territory that that geolocator was initially deployed. Get out of here, baby! It is the geobird. Key to golden wing warbler and all neotropical migratory songbird success is full life cycle conservation. So where do these birds winter? Where do they stop over on migration? These units will give us that information. With that information, we're better going to be able to allow conservation efforts to align. So to make sure where we work on the wintering grounds is aligning with where we work on the breeding grounds and everywhere in between. Good work, little buddy. 